Hi friends, hope you're doing good. Welcome. Welcome again to one more jump rope session with the cross rope amp handles and the cross rope app. This is in response to a question or a comment uh, posted by one of the viewers in one of our earlier videos. The viewer is MRWANSHNK. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce it, but uh, that is the name of the user. And the question and, and the comment was well done. Thank you very much. Could you compare 1000 jumps of AMP cross rope with Apple Watch to see how many calories you can burn? Okay, good question. That is what we will test today. I have the AMP handles with me ready, the Apple Watch on my wrist. What I'll do is connect the AMP handles to the cross rope app and do a quick 1000 jump uh, workout today. And let us see the caloric uh, burnt numbers between the uh, cross rope app and the Apple Watch. Uh, I'll go with the free jump option. Uh, usually what I do is I pause the workout uh, before I uh, resume the workout. Uh, but for this workout, I don't think I'll pause, pause the uh, workout on the app. I will surely take breaks, but I won't pause it on the app. We'll uh, stop the workout once we have completed the thousand jumps. And then I'll keep taking screenshots uh, of the app and the uh, Apple Watch, which we'll keep comparing on the screen. I really don't know the answer of how much calories the app was going to show and how much calories or how many calories the watch is going to show. I will also know it only once uh, we finish this video. Now let's go and jump. Okay, friends, so uh, the amp is connected to the app. Let me go to free jump, right? Let me say get started. I'll need to set up the phone somewhere I can see. What I'll do is I'll keep it on my sofa, resting like this so that I can see. Glasses off, let me keep it here. And like I told in the earlier video, I don't have to go near the phone to start the workout, pause the workout or resume the workout. I can do all that from the amp handle. So here we start, three, two, oh, before that, let me stop, sorry. I need to, let me end this workout, yeah. Okay, let me start the uh, jump workout. Let me keep taking screenshots of the Apple Watch also. So I've started the Apple Watch jump rope workout and I'm starting the cross rope amp. I'll take screenshot once we take the first break. Let's start. I won't move around much because I will go out of the camera frame. By the way, I'm using the quarter pound jump rope. Not too heavy, not too light, feels comfortable. And like I told in the earlier video, one good thing about the Amp and the app system is I have stopped counting. I'm fully focused only on the jump. And the difference that I have seen is I jump longer. I jump longer without the break. For example, earlier when I was counting, when I'm approaching numbers like 100 jumps or 200 jumps or 300 jumps, I kind of get conscious about that milestone and typically end up tripping. So I haven't been counting. Let me glance at the app. Nice, 190. Yesterday I did a 2000 plus jump plus a little bit of other workouts. So my leg is a bit hurting. But let's see how long I can. Go. Two eighty seven.
300 plus. We are going at around 135 jumps per minute. J E M. Three seventy. When you're not counting, you're actually conscious of where you're jumping. For example, on the wall opposite to me, I had some family photos. Looking at them, recollecting the memories, not focused on the number of jumps, actually opens up your eye, the surroundings. Oh, we did 500. I think we'll stop now. Nice. So we've done 517 jumps. Let me take a screenshot. Where are the buttons? Come on. Okay. Okay. I locked the phone. Oh, come on. Okay, so 518 jumps. I don't see the calories now. Only once we finish the workout, we'll see the calories. And now let me take a screenshot of the watch. 4 minutes 35 seconds. Uh, 4 minutes 35 seconds. I hope the screenshot is working. 38 calories. Okay. Enough of a break. Let's restart, otherwise my phone will go to sleep. is blowing into my ear but if I move I'll move out of frame so I'll, I'll tolerate it approaching 700 700 done We are going at 140 JPM, jumps per minute. Let's pass now. Okay, 
Let the app keep running and I'll start jumping. Only issue is I don't want the phone to go to sleep and get locked. Okay, let me take a screenshot. When I take a screenshot, I don't know why the workout passes. Okay, 7 minutes, 17 seconds, 62 calories, 148 beats per minute. Okay, let me not move the jump rope. I don't want the app to think I'm jumping. Oh, I have to take a screenshot, right? Done. Okay. So, shall we start? Okay. when you jump. Do you look up? Do you look straight? Do you look down? Leave a comment. I tend to keep looking up. Which I guess is not a good form. What about you? Where do you look when you jump? Thousand. Just a little bit extra. One zero two two. I will pause it. Pause. Let me put on my glasses back so that I don't struggle to see what's happening. Okay, much better. End session. Okay. Congrats. You exercised for thirty five minutes and earned Chad's birthday challenge badge for Chad's birthday challenge. Happy birthday, champion Chad. Happy that I completed the challenge and unlocked the medal. Okay. Let me take a screenshot of this also. Close this. Okay. Let me take a screenshot of this also. Okay, so uh, as per the app, uh, it was 1022 jumps, 517 was the best streak, meaning the unbroken jumps, which was the first set. Average jumps per minute was 106, that is because we didn't pause between our sets. If we had paused, it would have been more accurate. And then the peak was 140. Average power was 8 watts, peak power was 11 watts. The total time taken, including all the breaks, was 9 minutes 36 seconds. <laughs> My watch is still running. And the total calorie we burn, as per the app, is 147 calories or KCAL, kilocalories. And as per the watch, it is close to 100. I guess the difference is possibly because the app knows that I'm using a quarter pound rope or a weighted rope so it factors in the extra energy that is needed to spin this rope rather than a normal PVC rope or a lighter rope that is my guess uh, let me stop this workout also I will paste the screenshots because I've been talking and taking screenshots and jumping I don't remember the numbers so I think it was 147 uh, kilocalories and about 100 kilocalories as per the watch uh, so I'll paste the outputs 
on the screen. I'm happy with both the outputs. And uh, I think the Crossroad app is integrated with the Apple Health uh, system. So the workouts from the app gets integrated with the Apple activity also. Pretty seamless coordination between Apple and the app. So that's it friends. Once I go back and look at the video, I'll add, the, add any other information that I have missed. And by the way, I'm really liking this cross rope handles, I mean the amp handles and the, and a lot of cross ropes that I own for the last three, four years. In case you're interested in buying the amp handle or any of the ropes or the ropeless system or any product in cross rope, you can get it at a 15% discount as a viewer of this channel. All you have to do is use the code KHK360 at the time of checkout in the discount code. Very simple, KHK360. That is the name of this channel also. Thank you for being here. Enjoy your jump. Stay safe. Take care. Bye-bye. And it's night here, so good night.